Man, put your hands up. Hands up, hands up. And worship the one that created you. God Hi. Was the only one that you Good afternoon. I like to welcome you to Poem Praise 2 and certainly peace and blessings be upon you. Now, uh, today's topic for afternoon food to eat on is going to be entitled Undercover Crush. What I mean by that? Let me give you a quick uh, information of what I'm talking about. Um, throughout my life, I'm thinking to myself, I'm undercover. After I look back on it in regards to uh, leaving one school where I was the minority. Wait a minute. Let me get it right. Leaving one school where I was with the majority, with my people, right? Leaving that school. Going to a school where I became the minority. Okay. So, uh, it's, it's only a few black people around. All right. Getting, getting called all out my name and told you it's an undercover crush. Okay, so I'm undercover. I'm in school with them. I know how they act. <laughs> I know how they think. What you think about me regarding the reflection of my skin. Okay. Work with them. Yeah, the open enemy. Yeah, he out there. Oh my goodness. What part of the game? Yeah, going through some things. But in regards when you're crushed... <laughs> told you it's an undercover crush. When you're doing things undercover, uh, they might not know who they're really dealing with because it's undercover, right? Think about the CIA, the FBI. Okay. So you're in there and, and you're working. So, therefore, you got to think of yourself in regards to some things that you're doing undercover, kind of like uh, you're playing chess. What's your next move? Think a couple of moves ahead. Now, playing checkers, okay, poker face, for real, because sometimes they like to do this and tap you, you know, I don't know, but as far as me personally, I'm not, hey, just call my name, you got to tap on me and carry it on, but sometimes they get a kick out of tapping on you, annoying you, just to see what you're going to do, just to see how you going to respond, part of the game, really don't make no sense, I'm trying to tell you, but Undercover, okay. Went here, went there. We really don't believe you. We got to look at the contract. We got to look up. Look up the information just to see if what you're saying is really true. Now, wait a minute. If it's really true. Now, who has lied? Told a whole bunch of stories. Cheated. Cheated us out of our, our, our name, our religion, our culture. Stolen. <laughs> Stole us from... Uh, Okay, lie, cheat, and steal. Okay. Now, since you think you lie, cheat, and steal, I'm going to do the same thing, right? Right. Pretty much. Think I'm like you, I don't even look like you. Think I'm going to be like you? No. Individual. Peculiar people. Mm, still trying to figure out who who are we don't know what to call us okay first we don't went from black and then we don't went from uh negro to to colored uh still trying to come up with some names well maybe we should call them african americans i don't know no i don't know what we should call them people we just uh so confused don't know what to call them hmm i'm just saying un un under undercover because some of y'all like, okay, where is she coming with this regarding this? What is she talking about? What is she going through? First of all, undercover crush. In order for you to actually get something uh, real fine, if you think about wine, they actually crush the grapes to get the juice, right? So something's contained. It's contained, right? In a containment. Then all of a sudden when you crush it, you actually going to get the flow. And when you get the flow, something's flowing. You got to let it go, right? Kind of like a waterfall. 
it's flowing it's no longer contained you might uh put up a dam but if you got enough power guess what's gonna happen to the dam something's gotta come down you can't keep all that pressure and that force without having an action with an eco reaction of what's trying to be contained so for my deep thinkers, when you got something contained as far as in your mind, as far as uh, your vision, as far as your plan, <laughs> understand you're going to have to push for sure. You're going to have to take certain types of blows. You're going to have to move out the way. Wait a minute. You thought you almost got me. Nice try. Move out the way. Uh-oh. You tried to get me on that side. Nice try. So she might have to lean with it for real in the physical in the spiritual in the mental <laughs> yeah I'm taking it a whole lot of different levels here basically because some stuff might take you back but you have to think okay wait a minute if I go back how am I going to go forward if I go back do you see it with my actions in order for me to go forward I have to think about it I'm going forward I have to mentally put that thought into action and have to start moving in order for me to actually go forward. Now you see, I got a little closer. I got a little closer. Now that was just something for, I was giving you something visual. But the fact that I said it, it was easy. The fact that I did one of these numbers, that was easy too. Did it real quick. But in reality, mm-mm. In reality, you could get ready to be trying to move forward and it go like this. Oh, that was just a little inch. But guess what? It was progress. I went somewhere. Then then you keep on working it at that level till you get your mind right, till you get your mind tight and be like, okay, I made a little inch. That's not a lot. So then you move a little bit more. Guess what? That was progress. Still moving in the direction that I want to go, which is forward. So uh, then all of a sudden you might have something hit you back. Wait a second. What the hell was that? Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. I got to get back to where I was at, which was right here. So therefore, yeah, I got to stay focused, focused, read. Okay. Got that plan. Okay. Understand. Okay. Understandable. Comprehend. Okay. Got that. A lot of things, a lot of things. Because sometimes when you're trying to go like this, you have stuff coming all at you. Be like, oh, shut up. let me put my shield up. <laughs> try, you try to hit me. You no, know, can't be having that. Uh-oh, why you got, the, got stuff hitting you on that side? Be like, oh, I got to put my hand up right there. Uh-oh, wait a second. Got the hands up. That's a position. That's a position. That's a position of prayer. What should I be doing? Okay. Let somebody else fight my battles. All right, let's put the hands down and let's receive something. Because, you know, if prayers, praises go up and blessings coming down, that's just like almost like rain in regards to the precipitation of what goes up and it comes down. All right, I had to give you something quick. I'm looking at time. Time is of the essence. I'm going to keep it moving because I got somewhere to go. But uh, I want you to be blessed and be encouraged by the undercover crush all right let's go into action go do some undercover stuff you know what i'm saying all right be blessed later y'all